to the start of another great week. My name is Joey and today is Monday, May 10th, 2021. We hope everyone had a restful weekend. Stay tuned for our core value announcement about commitment. We hope you had a totally you have a totally fantastic day. Just begun A brand new day, no time to waste Gonna get it done So many plans, so much to do But that's okay, I'm gonna see it through Cause day after day And time after time I'm gonna do what I say I made up my mind I'll follow through Don't you forget it, oh yeah Gonna make you a plan, I know I can See it to the end Every moment I keep on it Do the best I can I won't give in, I won't give up No, gotta give my all and that's enough Today in history, on May 10th, 1869, the presidents of the Union Pacific and Central Pacific Railroads meet in Promontory, Utah, and drive a ceremonial last spike into a rail line that connects their railroads. This made transcontinental railroad travel possible for the first time in U.S. history. No longer would western-bound travelers need to take the long and dangerous journey by wagon train and the West would surely lose some of its wild charm with the new connection to the civilized East. Since at least 1832, both Eastern and Frontier statesmen realized a need to connect the two coasts. It was not until 1853, though, that Congress appropriated funds to survey several routes for the Transcontinental Railroad. The actual building of the railroad would have to wait even longer as north and south tensions prevented Congress from reaching an agreement on where the line would begin. For all the adversity they suffered, the Union Pacific and Central Pacific Railroad workers were able to finish the railroad, laying nearly 2,000 miles of track by 1869, ahead of schedule and under budget. Journeys that had taken months by wagon train or weeks by boat now took only days. Their work had an immediate impact. The years following the construction of the railway 
were years of rapid growth and expansion for the United States, due in large part to the speed and ease of travel that the railroad provided. Hey, we'd like to go ahead and end the announcements. Um, but before we do, we hope that you have a super day learning here at Bearsville. And um, we just want to remind you about this Bearsville expectations. Strive to do your best. Take responsibility for your actions. Always be safe. And respect everyone. At this time, we're asking everyone to please stand for the playing of the national anthem. And then you'll do the pledge in your classroom. Have a great day, everyone.